he's not just a coach, he's not just a friend, I mean, he's a mentor. I mean, he changed my life. It was a special feeling strapping up a Culver Bulldog singlet and stepping on the mat. He's just there for you all the time. A lot of respect to that man. You gotta respect what he's done here in Culver. I always tell people that being a wrestling coach isn't any different than being a heroin addict or something. That the uh, only difference is if you're an addict of a drug, a few bucks in your pocket, you can predict your next high. You never know when that's gonna come as a wrestling coach. You just gotta be ready to jump on and dig your heels in and hang on, because uh, you don't know how long it's gonna last, but you sure as hell don't wanna get bucked off. He made me a promise when I first wrestled, because I played basketball and I was supposed to be a basketball star. And he made me a promise that we were gonna go places. And uh, that promise came true. Go dogs! Legs back, belly wrap works with your legs back! We wrestled for big championship! I think that he puts all, all of his time and effort into it. You know, when you walk through my locker room, slap your two hands up on the door and it's time to wrestle. Probably one of the best guys I've ever met. So. He's just an amazing person to be around, honestly. He's as good a man as there is. He just tells us, you know, if you want to be a champ, you gotta, you gotta act like a champ.